Hi all, it's a fan from TechCycle. In this video, I'm going to show you guys a method by which you can earn money by renting your storage space which is left unused on your computer. That is the space you don't use on your computer. You can rent that and you can get money by renting that space. So let's begin to this tutorial. So the application we are using is called Xcore. If you are concerned about why we are renting this storage space, why are they using that storage space? They are using this storage space for xCloud cloud service. xCloud is also an, another product from Indian XT which is a cloud platform like Google Drive, Dropbox and Winbox. They are same but a little bit more secure and more efficient cloud service. I am going to talk about that in another video if I am making one so we are going to only record the tutorial for xcore right now so some things to note if you are following this guide is that the payout you receive from this indian xt is a digital currency they are going to pay you in inxt tokens so it is a digital currency like bitcoin so you need to keep that in mind if you are following through this journey and another thing to note is that you will be paid about 0.02 dollars for every GB you run. So that is like for every gigabit you are going to get about 0.02 dollars. This is not a correct value, this is like an estimated value which I got from the Xcore creator. So if you want to get the correct value you can do all the calculation from Xcore white paper which is going to be linked in the description so you can do all the calculation easily so you will you know how much you are going to get if you sign up for this project another thing to notice that you need to have port forwarding enabled for a particular port that is mentioned by this xcore application while setting up this xcore application and at last a simple thing to notice that make sure that your device is powered on all the time and make sure that you got a good internet connection and uh, you need to have an unlimited connection because you are going to transfer data through internet so you don't get charged so make sure that you are doing it in a profitable way that is you are not going to pay for the internet or you are not going to pay for the power you are using for your laptop so make sure that you are doing it in a profitable profitable way don't go don't go for a loss business so keep all that thing in mind so let's jump into this tutorial so I doubt the link in the description to download this Xcore application. It is a very simple application and it is very easy to set up. So install that application and open this Xcore on wallet address field. Enter your wallet address where you are storing this digital currency. Where you need to store this digital currency you are going to get from this Xcore application. You can use Coinbase or any other wallet. It's up to you. So after that choose the location where you need to store that file you are getting from this xcore application next on storage allocated you need to enter the amount of storage or memory you want to allocate for this xcore application so after choosing the location enter your ip address you can get the ip address by searching what's my ip on google so you can get your public ip address enter your public ip address on this xcore application while setting up the public IP address, make sure that your public IP address is static one. If the public IP address changes, make sure that you change this node and create another node with the new public IP address. That is just close this Xcore application and create a new node by keeping the new public IP address. And after that, just press connect it is going to create a node for you which is what they are calling that is simply it is going to connect to you through this x core so you can start making money so you are not going to make any money until you enable the port so it will show you guys a port so just open that port on your router or modem so head over to your router uh, page and on the port forwarding section enable that port for your local IP address and voila you are going to start making money by renting your storage space so that's all about this renting unused space to make money from your PC so it's a very simple steps and if you are finding any problem just come down below I'll be happy to help you if I can so make sure that you are doing it in a legal 
and profitable way if the digital currency is illegal on your country you are going to be in trouble for the exchange and all that sort of things so make sure that you are doing it in a legal way and another thing is to notice that in a profitable way so if you are if you calculate the money you are going to spend for the internet and money you are going to spend for the power make sure that you are making that money by renting that space so keep that in your mind before investing on this x score so that's all about this video guys thanks for watching talk to you next one and don't forget to subscribe